Hey everyone, this is Scott with Apps Know How, and uh, we're going to be covering kind of a cool uh, little app. Frankly, it's a little bit more for young people, um, but it is fun. Um, if you have a bunch of uh, friends or people that you want to send pictures to, um, this is how it works. It's called Snapchat, and Snapchat is uh, it's kind of an interesting social type of app. It is free in the, the Play Store for Android. It's free in the Apple Store for the Apple products, and it should be free for um, Windows and BlackBerry also. But when you open up Snapchat, um, the first thing you're going to see is, uh, obviously this is set up for me right now, but uh, there's a, a list of uh, snaps that have been sent out or pictures and videos that have been sent out. You can actually um, add people. Um, when you add a person, they get a message sent to them. They have to receive it or accept it, and then they're part of your group. And frankly, um, once they're part of your group, you can uh, send them a video or a picture. And so this is kind of what it looks like. If I were going to uh, take a picture of my keyboard, which is kind of dirty right now, unfortunately, um, basically I press in this uh, circle right here, and it snaps a picture, right, just like that. So you can see now it doesn't move. Now there's a couple things that I can do to annotate this. First, if I just tap on the screen, <clears throat> I can type out whatever I want and it shows up on the screen. I can move this around so if I have something in the picture that I want people to see and highlight it with uh, uh, words, um, you can do that very easily. Uh, I can also tap up here uh, on this little pen and I can draw on my picture. I can draw on different colors, uh, I can do all kinds of funny things. Uh, people can make shapes and uh, when they take a picture of people, they can draw a hat on them or whatever they want. You know, it's just kind of fun. That's really what this is all about is fun. Now the buttons at the bottom here, let me zoom in on that a little bit. Um, the first one is uh, how long somebody can see your picture. Now I want to make this clear. When you send a picture to somebody using this application, they can only look at it for X number of seconds, in this case 10. If you send them a video, which we'll do in a minute, they can watch the video once and that's done. They can't watch it again, they can't get the picture back. Um, so it's kind of a interesting way of doing things, but you can set that time to something other than 10 seconds if you want. As you can see, but I like 10 seconds, frankly, because sometimes the pictures are hard to understand until you actually see them for a few seconds. Um, <clears throat> this button right here allows people to actually look at your pictures or videos for 24 hours. Uh, it's called the the story, um, or your story essentially. Um, pretty cool. If you do want something to be seen a little bit longer, you can set that up. I do not. Um, once you have your picture done, you tap on this little arrow and it sends it, but now you get to choose who you're going to send it to. I'm actually just going to send this to myself because it's kind of a silly picture. So I pick myself and I hit the send button again. Now I'm in the list of all of the pictures and videos that have been sent. And once it comes through, notice that it's a dark red and I can actually press on it. Well, actually in a second here. Um, you can see that one is, these two are, I haven't looked at yet. These I have looked at. Um, well, let's just try. Nope, it's not going to let me. So anyways, once you... Um, receive the picture. I don't know why it's taking so long to send to me, but anyways, you press on it, and as long as you're pressing on it, it's using up those 10 seconds. You let go, it leaves the picture, but it's still counting down those 10 seconds. You press back again, and you can see the remainder of the 10 seconds. So, it really is kind of a quick thing, and that's why it's sort of for young people, you know. I'm going to send a silly picture to somebody, and they can watch it for 10 seconds and then come back to it, or not come back to it, I mean. So, there are some settings that you can change, you know, various things. You do have to have an account set up for this, which is pretty normal for apps nowadays. Um, but frankly, this is really a fun app called Snapchat. Um, it really does uh, cause a lot of laughs and uh, you can have some crazy things sent. So if you're interested in something like this, uh, this type of social media um, app, go ahead and pick it up. It's free. It's fun. You do have to have a group of people you're going to send it to, otherwise it doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> but once you have that, Go ahead and have a blast. It's great at parties, too. Um, uh, it's free, so it's kind of nice. Uh, and that's pretty much what it, Snapchat's all about. So if you like the video, go ahead and give it a, uh, a like. Subscribe. i got a lot more videos coming. Um, and uh, 
Again, this is Scott with uh, Apps Know How. We'll see you on the next video.